Hey everyone, this is Lucky7DX, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Last episode, we almost finished up Mystic Forest Plus, so let's go ahead and do this Donkey Kong fight. Now, like the one in regular release Mystic Forest, this one also has uh, bombs and conveyor belts and all that madness, but obviously the big difference is, well, the conveyor belts are a little smaller, I think. Although I actually like this setup as opposed to Mystic Forest, I feel like this one's a bit easier, actually. But the other big difference is, obviously, there's bombo floors, and the bombs will destroy them. So my suggestion is just stay on one side. I like the right side, personally. Um, I mean, the left side will get destroyed in the process, but as long as you take care of all the bombs on the right, it's not a big deal. And for some reason, the conveyor belts just seem to be a lot easier to deal with here. So, I think you can do it without a problem. Ah, 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 ah. There we go. Alright, and of course this is where, this is where it gets harder because you're going to throw more bombs, but it shouldn't be a problem. I'm going to go for this one, or I'm going to go for this one, or one of these ones. Ah, uh, this is, is going to be tough to pull off. Oh, that was about to blow up any second there. <laughs> hey, there we go, first try. That's what I like to see. That's exactly what I like to see. Alright, let's take care of this. And Mario is about to get thrown into the abyss of, un of blue nothingness there, but that's okay. Mini Marios, you can betray me all you want, because I got them my first try. And now that I've said that, they're probably going to betray me a ton in this next world, because World 6, Twilight City. You remember how hard this was when I had the keys only. You do know it's going to get even harder now. <laughs> this world, actually, you know, I actually think it's harder when you have to do the keys than you have to do here. This world isn't too bad if you know what you're doing. From what I remember. And I hopefully I'll be right on that. Well, the first thing we do, well, obviously we have to deal with lasers now. I mean, oh, those lovely lasers. So, but I, so we have to kind of time it so both Mario and Mini Mario don't get killed by them. And go now. Got the present, hit the yellow switch, and then we're gonna head back. And you can make it so you can just run enough time and you can get there. Alright, so let's continue. Or er, shoot, I have to hit the red. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Why would I forget to do that? Alright, that's probably gonna cost me in time, but I'm gonna finish this level anyway. Alright, so jump up here, and don't, don't, no, 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 no! Oh my god, he made it, he made it! I'm so happy about that. Alright, we don't want him to jump down here. Okay, fine, you know what? Be retarded. You damn mini Mario. Get up there and stay- Okay, fine, I'll make you go up there. <sighs> These guys are so frustrating. I thought I could save time by doing that, but apparently I can't. Well, this is gonna bode poorly then. Hurry up and get over here, you damn mini Mario. Alright, now that he's out of the way, we've got to grab the, tra the trash can now for ourselves. Uh, I've wasted way too much time in this one. This is not gonna work out, but whatever. That's fine, that's fine. I'll, like, I'll just have to deal with it. Alright, and throw the trash can down here. It's a simple matter of just getting to the end. Alright, get to the- get to the- there we go! I hate how I have to kind of like... It's just not very sensitive to where, like, getting the end and going there. And yeah, I did miss it. Not by much. I can easily get that when I actually know what I'm doing. So I'm gonna cut back and get that. Are you serious? He like, just barely touched that. You damn any Mario running into lasers. How stupid are you? Alright, plenty of time. Yeah, that was just me being really stupid. Now, I'm not even going to blame anyone else but myself for screwing that one up. That was completely my fault. Oh well, we have gotten that one done, and there's only five more regular levels left in the game than one Donkey Kong, and then the final boss. Hey wait, it's a three life? You've been seeing a three life in videos. My god. Let's get it. And here we see the exclusively rare blue mushroom. It gives you three lives. Or three dice blocks. Now it's a golden mushroom. Mario Party reference for the win! Alright, we have uh, Evil Trash Monster from Hell there, so uh, as usual we're gonna have to uh, protect our mini Mario. Let's protect our toys! Ow! That hurt. Alright, come on little guy, we're in a hurry here. And we're gonna make sure he doesn't die here, and then we're gonna keep going. Okay. So, um, yeah, what we need to do is we need to go over here and grab that present for starters. So that's exactly what we're gonna do, and hopefully that wrench doesn't hit him. Okay, apparently the wrench does not kill Mini Mario, because he definitely jumped into it like an idiot. But we've kind of established that Mini Mario is an idiot by now, so whatever. Let's just simply go ahead and beat this level. That one's actually really easy. I mean, I expected the wrench to hurt him, because that would actually make the level slightly challenging, but... Either I got really lucky, or it just doesn't. 
You saw the mini Mario though, you saw him, he tried to commit suicide on me. You saw that. He did try to kill himself. Okay, you know we're just gonna get a green mushroom, because who cares? Um, ooh, I like this level actually, this one's kinda cool. <laughs> all three presents are right in a row there. Uh, but this one's all about holding them, uh, well, they're not monkeys technically, but holding these guys' tail things. And then timing it so the mini Mario doesn't die as you walk across. That's basically all there is to this level, really not that hard. So just hold it a little bit, and now it should be good. Because, yeah, otherwise, no, uh, grab it when he's going this way. Yeah, that way he'll keep facing to the left. And simple matter of just going from here. And now what you want to do is climb up all the way, and just fall. And get all three presents in, like, the space of, like, half a second, which is kind of funny. There we go. Yeah, see, Twilight City Plus is just not that hard. At least not so far. The last level I remember is really interesting, and I don't even—I wouldn't even call it hard. It's just interesting. Oh my God, it's the blue mushroom again. Is it another stop arrow? Oh, look at all these stop arrows I'm getting. Man, I'm liking this. Finally, we get like the, the quick mini game that doesn't waste all my footage. It's about freaking time. Six four. Um, this level, this level. This, oh, this one's actually kind of tough. Okay, well. It's mostly just laser dodge and stuff, so we can handle it. Um, alright, this part's a little tricky. I, I like to wait for this one first, and then go, just kind of ride it out. Wait, don't get hit by that one. Oh, that was way too close. Okay. Here you have to be a little clever. Um, what you want to do is you want to throw that guy down there, and you want to make him drop. And then, what you want to do is go down here to the red switch. And then, you want to bring the Mar Mini Mario so he falls down there. That is what you want to do, right? Wait. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, we want to ride this guy across. That's right. Okay. I know what I'm doing. If I hit the blue switch, he'd actually fall down over there. That's right. It's the one time you don't want to actually trap the mini Mario. Trapping the mini Mario is actually bad for once. Usually it's not the case in these levels. Alright. If, if that just costs me my time, I'm going to be so ticked off. Come on. Be nice. Oh, thank you. All right, there we go. We're done with that, and uh, well, we're inevitably we're gonna get swap boxes eventually. You know, what, just for the hell of it, let's go ahead and do it. Let's go. Let's let. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna pick. He's gonna be random, 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 random. random. What's good? Give me the blue. What's in the blue? What's in the blue? It's actually not the good one, is it? <laughs> it's one life. I keep getting one life. All right, let's move on. Oh God, more bombs. Oh, this level. This one's annoying. I forgot all about this one. Oh, this is all. It's not annoying so much as it's clever. So, what you need to do is you need to stop this thing for starters and then grab a bomb. Obviously, if you grab a bomb, we're gonna need to grab many bombs in this level. Now, bring this one over here and throw it up here and it'll blow up that thing up there. Now, up here is one of the little reversing the conveyor belt things. You need to hit that. Uh, and now, here's where things get clever. And here's also where I die like an idiot. Well then, um, I, I don't know what to say to that. But that's okay, you know what, that's that's how life goes. Alright, um, why don't I just cut to that part. <laughs> or I can just die, that, that works too. Uh, I'm gonna cut all the way to where I was before. Alright, let's try this again, shall we? Uh, now that this is gone, you want to put this thing on here, kind of wait for it a bit, and then drop it. Oh, I got so lucky he didn't die there. Uh, I, was to, I forgot to hit the thing up there. <laughs> well, that's actually rather fortunate, um, but I do want to hit the thing up there anyway, so let's go uh, ahead and do that. Because you actually need that to get the present down there easier as well. Now, normally what you want to do is you want to hit that so the mini Mario doesn't get there so quickly. Because usually he'll just run to it and die. Uh, i wait for it a bit, and then I'm going to drop it should drop all the way down there. And that was kind of glitching a little bit there. Wow. Okay then. Um, that looked really weird. Alright, so now we're just gonna make it over here. Uh, that thing, the conveyor belt is slowed on the mini Mario, so that gives you time to go get the present without the mini Mario jumping on a spring like an idiot and wasting time. And I think I should make this still. I went through that pretty fast. Yeah, plenty of time. Alright, so we only have two more levels left of this game. Actually, oh, one actual level and one DK level. So yeah, we're gonna finish the game in this, well, not the act the whole game, but we're gonna get to the final part in this video. How awesome is that? Man, we are almost done. I just finished up ages and we're almost done with this too. Uh, now in case you guys have been wondering about my LP schedule, by the way, um, 
I'm gonna be... Oh, I'm not 99, that sucks. I'm gonna be uh, starting both new LPs, because I'm gonna start... I'm gonna you know, keep doing just two of them. I'm gonna start them both on 10-10-2010, because that's just really cool. Um, yeah. Cheesy, yes, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get this present. This is the last level. This one's... There's not there's really anything that can hurt you, but it's just... It's, it's more of a puzzle level. So what you need to do, first of all, is get me Mario up here, get over here. Uh, get over here! It's like Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Uh, you wanna also grab the trash can with you as well. Now, go over here, make sure he gets up here with you, and hit the blue. Now, jump over here, and your guy's gonna drop down there and be trapped. Good, we don't want him around. No, no, no! I want the trash can! Damn it! I hate the throwing up mechanic in this game. There's one mechanic I really am bad at, it's the throwing up one. And I just took that down with me anyway. Okay, you know what? This is just going stupid. Stupid. Alright. I got the present up here, right? Good. Now what you need to do, you want to throw this one up, and you want to quickly run down here, and hit the red. There we go. And now just let Mini Mario make his way over up top there. So you need to, you need to actually hit the red before the trash can gets, goes away. Which is kind of, you have to kind of rush a little bit, but it's not too bad. Simple matter of grabbing the last treasure, and... There we go. Last level of the game completed. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's cool. It's tricky. It makes you think a little bit. It's a nice little puzzle, and I didn't make it in time. Ah, oh, look at the last level of the game! Really? Whatever. I'll get it when I beat it. I'll get me guy. Be right back. Man, it's funny how easy it is to do it the second time once you remember how to do everything. I just did that really fast. Okay. So there we go. Last uh, normal Golden Star in the game. Only one more left, and that's the final Donkey Kong fight. So, let's go ahead and take care of the oh, swamp boxes, really? Really? You know, whatever. I have plenty of time. Um, yeah, because I'm going to end the episode, obviously, after the bo uh, boss. And, you know, that'd be a nice final episode. The final boss of the game. And there are going to be extra videos. I actually need to shuffle those gold stars to do. And, well, I'm not going to say anything, but you'll see. You'll see what they are uh, in the extra videos. There should be one or two of them, depending on how long they take. All right, final Donkey Kong fight of the game. And once again, it's this little... We can do this little dance of lasers and conveyor bells and bombs and all that fun stuff. But, just like before, I mean, it's not actually that much different, really. I'm just, like, not sure what the difference is, actually, for that matter. I'm not sure what makes it so different. Alright. As usual, you just want to kind of counter the, uh, every time Donkey Kong hits, hits the thing, you just kind of want to counter it with your own little tap. So, just kind of go around this pattern and look for when Donkey Kong hits it and just reverse what he does. And that's actually going to... Oh, I, that was... that was dumb. That was really dumb. That was unfathomably dumb. I just ran right into that laser like an idiot. You know, whatever. We have our moments. Ooh, that was close. Whatever, he's dead. I think maybe the bombs go off quicker? That's a possibility. That's the only thing I can think of, because it's not like this part is really that much harder. Actually, it's not even really any different. Other than that, I guess the bombs do just go up. Maybe, maybe that's maybe that's it. I think you, I think those red bombs do go up differently than the other ones do. So that's a possibility. Oh, I knew he was gonna hit that. Ah, uh, whatever. This is worth. Oh, it's going over there, but too late. All right, we're gonna wait for this one. We're gonna wait this one out. Yeah, I guess that's the only problem is you have a lot longer of the bombs. I guess I don't know. Stop it! Just take the bomb like a man. Or ape thing. Be a good Donkey Kong. You know you want bombs in your face. Oh, that's the last one. Oh my god, I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna beat it. Oh, you bastard. Don't you dare. I refuse to let you get away with that. <laughs> Donkey Kong has been defeated. Once more. Alright guys, so uh, there's obviously going to be a cutscene following this video, or this thing, so we're going to go see what score I get, which obviously is going to be a gold star. And that's, there we go, last gold star in the game. We have all the gold stars now. We're a Model A student! But yeah, we're good to go. So with that, this is Lucky7DX signing out. I'll see you next time for cutscenes and the final battle. Awesomeness.